Hello kindergartners, welcome back to a new letter. Today our letter has a two different shapes in it. Hmm, what letter is this? It's a P. For our P, I see two shapes. Right here, we have a big line. And right here, a little curve. So if I were to take my sticks, I would have my big line down and my little curve would go at the top, just like that. If I did a big curve, that would make a different letter. Try to think what it would be. That's right, it would be a D. We don't want any Ds here. We just want a little curve for our P. So to make our P, we're going to start at the top, make a big line down, frog jump to the top, little curve, just like that. Little P and big P look kind of the same, but there is a difference on where they are on the paper. So if I was making my line on the top, line on the bottom, dotted line in the middle. Let's start at the top. Big line down. Little curve. Just like that. My curve goes from the top line to the middle line. If I was doing my little P, it would start and go below into the basement. But we're not doing those today. We're just practicing our capital P, our uppercase. So I'm going to do another one next to it. See if you can see what's going on. Big line, little curve. Uh-oh, I started at the bottom. We're supposed to start at the top when we do our letters. Let's try that again with our starting at the dot. Big line down, frog jump, little curve. Just like that, make sure we do our frog jumps because if we end up going big line down, little curve, that's a different letter. That's not the letter that we want. So make sure we're gonna do our big line down, frog jump, little curve, just like that, and you'll have a P. Keep practicing with your homework, kindergartners. Trace all those letters. We wanna see you trying your best. Have a great day. Bye-bye.